Well, he was, uh, he's obviously one of the greats. And uh, uh, so any, um, just, I don't want to, you know, whatever you want to talk about is fine, you know, or interested in any stories about Asimov, but of course, you know, Hubbard, uh, anything. Um, were you in uh, New Jersey as well? Did you? Yeah, I got an HTA in, in Elizabeth, New Jersey. Now, did, was that taught by Ron himself? Or? No, Ron uh, was primarily in L.A. He used to get on a plane and fly in to give us a lecture once a week. And uh, I recall one time he came in uh, and uh, he had worked out this business about ARC and he started talking about that. We auditors were sitting there and we didn't want to hear about ARC. We wanted to hear about how to yank out engrams. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, he came in once a week and lectured to us. Campbell did too. He lectured you? Yeah, Campbell, Campbell's primary thesis was once a week he'd come in and uh, he would teach us how to harangue the guy who's haranguing you when you're giving a talk. Ah, uh, sure. And uh, I, I remember what he'd do is uh, I don't know, I, I started laughing and in the middle of trying to do what he wanted to do, he says, you fail, sit down. <laughs> <laughs> I would heckle the heckler. Yeah. Yeah, Kimball was a very approachable person, too. Mm -hmm. yeah. Now, this was a Dianetic uh, course? Yeah, this was uh, taught at Elizabeth, New Jersey. Okay, but Campbell come, would come in and be the sort of yeah. the instructor on a Dianetics yeah. course. Matter of fact, most of the furniture in the place had come from uh, his wife and him. I don't think they ever got it back, but uh, when bankruptcy occurred, mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, he was very active in setting it all up originally. Yeah, I've read a bit about his what he's had to say about it, and it seems like he was very enthusiastic in the uh, in the early beginnings, and then by say, uh, well, his public his publisher stopped him from continuing the stuff in the book in the magazine. Was that it? Yeah. And uh, but he and Peg practice original Dianetics for the day they each died. It mm. just they did not go into Scientology at all. Which was somewhere around seventy one as I recall. Um, I, yeah, I don't recall. I remember when I don't remember but I was told about it when he was sitting there watching the first moon landing in a chair. He was at, I believe he was at uh, the science fiction writer Green's house at the time, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, he was sitting there watching the moon landing. He says, he says, uh, now I feel vindicated. Uh-huh. My first landing, yeah. Yeah. Ah, sure. I read where he gave Asimov the idea or told him what the three, the three laws, laws of, of robotics, robotics yeah. were. That's true. That's an amazing story because yeah. that's the you know, such a phenomenal uh, aspect of yeah. the robot series. Well, when Ike, when Ike says, well, you gave this to me, he says to Ike, he says, well, it all came out of what you said. It was all in your stuff. He just synthesized it out of Ike's. Yeah, amazing. 